long time no see. I'm getting ready to go on a little day trip for work and well it's actually a less than 48 hours trip but I'm still going on a trip for work and I thought I would take you along with me because when else do I ever decide to film? So I'm going on a day trip up to Idlewild. The company I work for runs a lodge up there and it's called the Grand Idlewild Lodge and I'm going to go stay for the night and get some content and I thought I would take you along with me. Of course, Nyx has to say hi. You shake. So I have got my stuff here. I'm bringing a jacket. It's the closest thing to a winter jacket that I have. My camera bag, my duffel bag full of my overnight things. And unfortunately, the little kitten can't come with me. I wish you could, because I feel bad for leaving you. And then the outfit that we've got going on is very winter-esque. We have a tree in the way. So we just have a black turtleneck and then this puffer jacket. I'm pretty sure I got at Old Navy a very long time ago. And the rifted, of course, jeans, and then the shoes that I wear all the time. So with that being said, I'm going to just gather my things. We're gonna go and I need to be there a little after four. I don't think I have to get gas, so I think I'm good to go. Okay, well, it is a little bright out and it is way too warm to be wearing all of what I'm wearing right now. I think I have everything. The hardest thing obviously is leaving my cat. We'll see how he does. I couldn't get my camera in my, be in my bedroom to connect because I updated it and now of course it won't connect to the internet or the app and that's fun. It should take, oh, an hour and 13 minutes. So I will get there a little later than I said I would, but that's because I was trying to ensure the safety of my cat by making sure that I had a camera to watch him when he sleeps, but I don't. So wasted my time and I'm wasting my time talking now. So I'm just gonna get on the road and uh, we're gonna go up a mountain. So who wants a room tour? I finally made it. I have not seen this specific room before. I think she says because it's a suite, but it's very nice. I am staying at the Grand Lodge in Idlewild. There's also the Creekstone right next door. So let me give you a little room tour. So and this is what it looks like when you first walk in. You have your coffee station. 
some coffee pods will not be drinking those because i don't like hot coffee but oh, they have hand sanitizer love that and then the ac <laughs> won't be using that either we have a cute fireplace they're all electric and a tv and then this ginormous bed this is the bathroom and the lights right here love this two headed shower love this bathroom oh hello i'm not sure what's in there but then we probably have a little closet oh <gasps> and robes how cute just a cute little closet and some robes not sure what's in there but kind of creepy oh my god look at how cute they have little coasters that's adorable well i think i'm going to facetime my parents show them where i am and then i'm going to go get some shots of the main lodge and then i'm going to probably go downtown and find some food because i am hungry so i will catch up with you later well i just got done walking around taking some videos and trying to get some photos but it got too dark so i'll just have to do that tomorrow which is no big deal um i'm hungry so i'm going to find some food okie dokie i found a place called fratellos i think is what it's called it's italian and obviously i love italian so that's where i'm gonna go it is definitely dark outside now um and it's only a three minute drive so this place is really close to everything downtown but that's where i'm gonna go and i will see you there Okay, well, um, it is 8.30 at night, so I will be getting ready for bed. It is dark outside and I have nothing else I can do. So we're just gonna get unready and I'm going to also film a little TikTok and call it a night. I totally forgot to bring my face wash. I'm just gonna have to wash my face with the bar of soap. I normally don't do that unless I'm in the shower. I'm also very picky and I use unscented Dove soap. Hopefully I don't break out. But this is a really cute bar of soap though. Just smells. It smells good, but it's scented obviously. So we'll see how my skin reacts. This CeraVe lotion is my go-to. I use it every single day of my life, all over my body and on my face. It's perfect. Well, 
now that I am all ready for bed, I am going <laughs> to get in bed. I have the fire turned on, set at a nice 68 degrees in here. Got family guy on, and we're going to bed. Well, I thought that before I actually go to bed, I'm going to read a little bit of my book. I am reading Never Lie by Frida McFadden. Tara Michelle has influenced my reading horizons, I guess, if you will, um, immensely. All of the books that she recommends I have added to my list and this was one of them. She said it was one of the best Frida books she has read. So I added it to my list, got it for Christmas and I'm already like halfway through. It's pretty good. I haven't got to anything really juicy yet but it is only halfway through so we shall see. Okay, forget what I said about not coming across anything interesting because I just came across something very interesting. Things are finally starting to hit that point where things are interesting. This is starting to get very good. So I might read a couple more chapters and then I'm going to head to bed. So I'm going to say good night and I will see you in the morning. Good morning. I never remember to bring like the important things, like dry shampoo. <sighs> so I got dressed. It's nothing crazy. It's freezing outside, so I wear the same turtleneck I wore yesterday, and then a sweater. I'm just going to get myself ready, and then they have breakfast downstairs. I'm going to take some photos of the breakfast some videos of the breakfast and then I'm going to eat the breakfast and I'm going to go about my day and do the long list of other tasks that I need to do. I already brushed my teeth, put in my contacts, washed my face. I'm just gonna put on some makeup so I don't look like this and then we're gonna go. Skylar Clean Beauty Lime Sands is my go-to every single day perfume. And it smells fresh and citrusy and clean. I don't know how else to describe it. It's perfect. I wear it every single day. Of course there's stuff on my shirt. And I didn't notice this until just now. Other than that, it look good. Cute. Nothing crazy. Literally just walking around a mountain town, taking photos, and little TikToks. camera died or it's getting close to it so I'm um, gonna film on my phone I just tried going into these really cute um, antique thrift stores I'm not really sure what they are but they're really cool uh, this one has books paperback books and hardcover books for the same price that I get them at revivals so I thought it'd be really cool to check out but it doesn't seem to have any hours on it, so I don't know if it's open. Okay, well, <clears throat> I drove around for a little bit, and 
there's a bunch of places I could go into and stop and see, but I kind of just really want to go home. I can always come back another time and get like the full Idlewild experience when maybe I'm able to stay for like a weekend or something. But I came and did what I needed to do, which was get videos and photos of each of the properties, the Grand and Creekstone. So I'm just home. It's a nice little trip. Thanks for watching my little 24 hours in Idlewild. Make sure to follow all of the social media profiles that I run for work. I'll have them all linked down below. Thanks for stopping by. See you next time.